So there's been a lot of talk about the Fracture case recently. Obviously the, the Fracture case has been going up in price. There's a lot of interest in it. To illustrate what I'm talking about, here it is here. It's gone from 20 cents all the way up to about 30 cents and started to fall back down. And this has got people interested because obviously it's a, it's a case that's dropping. Previously it's been worth pretty much nothing. And so people have been wondering why it's been going up. Now, there's two reasons for that. First of all, currently Recoil Case, Dreams and Nightmare Case, Snakebite Case, Fracture Case and Clutch Case are being dropped. When Valve do release a new case outside of an operation, one of these cases will be discontinued. And typically discontinued cases, as, as of late, have gone up in value a lot. If we go like Prisma 2 case, for example, this one's recently discontinued. This might be a bad example, but <laughs> Prisma 2 case, for example, you know, it was... It hasn't gone up much yet, actually. I think the joke's on people. But anyway, there's this expectation that these things will get more expensive if they get discontinued. And obviously, one of these cases need to be discontinued when another case is released. Aside from the operation cases, they don't count. So people are very interested. And there's a lot of people who think the Fracture case will be the next case to be discontinued. So if we go to CSGO Market Reddit, basically, Valve will normally discontinue the actively dropping case that's been being opened the least. And the, you know, the Fracture case, you can very clearly see, is being opened the least out of all five actively dropping cases. Like, it's not even close. So people really think this is likely to be the next case removed. And cases on the whole are getting a lot more expensive. So naturally, people are looking at this thinking this is the next big opportunity. But there is another reason. So there's a, there's a YouTuber called, German YouTuber called Trilix. He mostly makes some um, German content. So he made a he made an investment video on cases talking about his investments. Now Moin, Moin, I can't I can't speak German, but I'm pretty sure at some point during this video he talks about fracture cases. I think that's encouraged more people because this came out on September the 4th. And if we look down here, immediately starts going up on September the 4th. So it makes a lot of sense, right? This video probably precipitated this rise here, but like even then, people are stocking up on massive amounts of them simply because they think it'll be the next one discontinued. It's not sustainable, it's coming back down. There's just too many of them being dropped and not enough being opened. And even with people buying up colossal numbers of them, like it looks like there's at least 2 million being stockpiled each month at least, it's not enough to get the price up, but this could backfire spectacularly on the people <laughs> who are doing it, by the way. I, I'm not, it's not an endorsement of it as an investment, just saying that's the explanation. That's where it's coming from. As you can clearly see, the people who bought it 30 cents have gotten wrecked, and that price is coming back down.